AARP Kansas volunteers were out in full force in 2018, working hard to advocate, educate, and serve 50 and older Kansans across the state. They advocated for work and save legislation to help Kansas workers save for retirement in the workplace, for SNAP legislation to ensure that vulnerable Kansans don't go hungry, and to protect Medicare and Social Security and support caregivers. They traveled the state giving presentations on the Kansas Lay Caregiver Act to help support caregivers and the person they care for when returning home from a hospital stay. Volunteers also had fun hosting an ice cream social and a food truck festival at the Grandparents Park in Wichita. It's like we're having a good turnout, we're having a good time, making some new friends and uh, meeting some old ones. Throughout the year, we invited Kansans in all areas of the state to join our team. We met up with them in fun places like Botanica, the Wichita Art Museum, and a winery near Salina. On AARP's annual day of service in September, volunteers and staff worked across the state making a difference in communities, including these Wichita area volunteers who spent the afternoon at the Kansas Food Bank packing snack packs for school children who, without these packs, would go hungry on weekends. Fraud prevention education was front and center in 2018 with a huge shred event in Wichita in which 11,000 pounds of personal documents were destroyed in order to protect against identity theft. AARP Kansas also hosted Frank Abagnale, a former con artist who is now working with AARP to warn consumers about scams and help them protect themselves from fraud. During the 2018 elections, AARP volunteers reached out to Kansas voters to engage them in the critical issues facing our state and country and encourage them to be the difference by raising their voice in the voting booth. Along with several partners, we co-sponsored a gubernatorial debate with our own Judy Davis Cole serving on the interview panel. We teamed up with veteran organizations across Kansas to provide information and resources to the men and women who have and continue to serve our country. It was a great pleasure to be able to sponsor a Kansas Honor Flight for a veteran to fly to Washington, D.C. Our annual volunteer recognition event celebrated and honored our Kansas volunteers with special recognition for Richard and Maxine Goucher, Edie Lockmiller, and Diana Kerner. And we presented our most prestigious Andrus Award for Community Service to Judy Davis Cole. Our tax aid volunteers assisted more than 28,000 Kansans in preparing and filing their taxes, and our driver safety team helped hundreds of Kansas drivers learn how to be safe on roads and highways, even offering a whole month of free classes in October. As the year came to an end, we said goodbye to Glenda Dubois, who served as our volunteer state president for six years, and hello to Judy Ballone, who will continue our work in the years to come. I think representing uh, all the 385 plus your members and then all of our volunteers has just been sort of a dream come true for me. It, it really and truly has and I've just been honored to have served and look forward to what the next steps are.